New tonight, a starter home for small businesses known as Box Lot announced it will be closing this month. And that means some businesses will lose their storefronts. Now, Box Lot opened in late 2019 and was designed to support small businesses. Local 24 News reporter Jalen Sochek spoke with the business owner about what this means for him. I just love the creativity of my socks. No one knows the importance a pair of socks makes on an outfit than Jeffrey Farmer. I've been collecting socks for over 15 years now, and um, I've spent so much money on socks, and it's like... I wonder what it would be like to have my own brand. That turned into this. Rock Your Socks, described as the first sock store in Memphis. He's one of three local tenants currently operating out of Box Lot, a shipping container small business incubator located in the Edge District. But in less than two weeks, Box Lot will be no more. The Memphis Medical District Collaborative that sponsored it said at its start, the space would be temporary. In a statement online saying, quote, they always planned for Box Lot to give us a glimpse of what was possible. It has been a fun ride that will soon come to an end. I would love to stay in that location. I love the intimate setting. It's like, you know, more the uh, bigger storefronts, like they have a lot of square footage. But with the shipping containers, it's only about 20 feet long. So. Um, I can interact with my customers. Farmer said he's sad to see the space go, and although he will no longer have a storefront, his experience left him better off as a business owner, thanks to his neighbors, Kickspins and Moe's Bows, a notable business once featured on Shark Tank. We always bounce back ideas of uh, how to do certain things, and since I'm new and they, they're pretty much veterans, uh, they just show me uh, how to do pretty much everything. He hopes to be a part of a similar venture in the future. Until then, he'll focus on selling his socks online. From the Edge District, Jalen Sochek, Local 24 News. We wish him well.